did do something I haven't done in quite some time. I pooped my pants on Monday, actually, a week ago oh, today. Well, right. Right. Yeah, I, hey. I, I pooped my pants. I, I haven't really felt poop in my underwear <laughs> while I'm wearing it in a long time. Fart poop? Poop. No, no, no. I'm talking poop? waterfall poop. Yeah, full pooping full in the pants. I'm talking throw out underwear, poop Ooh. your pants. I'm I not just. Know this. I'm not talking. Yeah, I've held I'm this so in. I'm so happy that you. <laughs> I've held this in since I've came in today. I've wanted since to share this so bad. Yeah, I was at a restaurant <laughs> that serves <laughs> public. No, no, no. Oh, I, no. I didn't. I didn't poop my pants till I got home. But while I was walking home, I knew, boy, I might. I might so poop my pants. Was it a? <laughs> no, no. It was someone just stabbed me in the stomach. Something is wrong here. I got a large margarita. Oh. And I got two tacos, and I'm so. not gonna, you know, say what restaurant it was, just because that be, was it. It was Condado on uh, Mass Ave. <laughs> okay. They serve tacos. <laughs> My only yeah. allegedly, allegedly, no, this this is Condado. I have the receipts. Uh, this is the first time I've been there in quite some time. I love the place. Never had a bad experience. And I put my pants on Monday. And <laughs> unfortunately, I cannot go back because it was bad. I mean, I, I, I this is brand new underwear, too. I have to also mention, I never get new clothes. You guys see how I dress. Yeah. Like dating. an asshole. Yeah. Like an asshole. I don't do it. Went to Lululemon. Got new what? Lululemon <laughs> underpants. Oh, not, no. cheap. Not, not cheap. Not cheap. Not cheap. And I filled them with poop. I could not. There was no Are opportunity. Was it tight? Oh, yeah. It was a box of briefs. It was like the nice. How oh. close were you to the bathroom when you pooped your pants? I was walking into the bathroom when I pooped my pants. It wasn't a situation where I could hold it, Tony. Okay, I was sitting on my balcony. My stomach hurt. I was clenching hard. I was clenching. I did not want to poop. I knew I had to wait. And I stood up because I was like, I better go sit on the toilet because something bad is going to happen. And as I'm walking to my bathroom, you get the whole so, like you, you feel it in your pants. The dam yep. broke? Yes, yep. the dam broke and I couldn't hold it. I, I, kept, I kept trying to hold it as I kept walking. More poop, more poop, more poop. I kept pooping my pants. And then actually the worst part about this was that when I finally got to the toilet, pants come off. Yeah. Toilet seat's still up. Oh, so I, got, I got a lot of poop on the toilet seat. I had to, <laughs> had to flip that up. I had to throw out my underpants. I had to clean my entire bathroom, which took like probably 45 an hour. So, I mean, poop on my hands. So does Lululemons have good catch rate, yes, you're saying? Oh. Lululemons are great. I mean, I was leaking down the backside of my legs for a, oh. for a while. Hey. but Hey, great break. Yeah. Aside from that, it, it was a really fun break. You have on? Aside from the just wearing underpants. Just, I, I, it only affected my underpants, but I oh had, again, new Lululemon sweatpants on, oh. and they still kind of smell like poop, and I oh. washed them twice. But aside from that, break was I played a lot of Hogwarts. Bird dogs on. All right, mm -hmm. Hogwarts. Uh, I fear is going to be forgotten about your yeah, break. I think so. The only thing we're going to think about is remember last break that we mm -hmm. took next year Connor. when we take right. the break. Yeah. Connor, try not to shit your pants. That's yeah. right. Hey, proud of you for really letting the world know that that's it's relatable. Fun. You know. Yeah. Hey, why wouldn't I share it? He's 27 years old. Hey, hey, 27. Exactly. Pooping your pants. Never no too young to poop your pants. That's right. I couldn't even imagine the fear that was running through your mind while you were getting close and you could feel the damn, oh, yeah. oh, mm -hmm. oh. And then once yeah. that thing goes, oh. you could not stop. I couldn't stop. It was, and I, when I did sit down, it was just, I've never had it like that before. We're like, I'm not, I'm not like, I'm, there's no push. This is our first show back. Yep. Yeah, I had to. I, Ten I had, minutes. I had to tell you guys. I know somebody that's excited to ask you a question. Gumpy, what do you got for Jet? <laughs> Well, well, well. <laughs> yeah. Good afternoon, Jet. <laughs> wow. you old bastard. God, your beard's even whiter than it was. I suppose that's what happens when you're an international fugitive. No! Oh, jeez. Oh, yes. oh, whoa. Might be getting that handled. Might be getting that handled. Someone better not be throwing you a damn pitch, Pat. No. I'm not going to do that today. Don't even try to sneak that shit by me, man. Come on. Oh, come on! <laughs> Make contact. Yeah. You still got to be vaccinated to play in Toronto yet? <laughs> Good no, question. No. Valid. Good question. I think that's done. So we're going to, you know, we're going to see everyone up there. Pat. What's Pat that? McAfee. We're playing baseball, Son Jack. of a bitch. Unbelievable. Oh, that's right up the front. <laughs> oh, it's in the gap. It's in the gap. Part two. Sorry about you. Part two. We have more room for baseball activities. Sorry. I mean, how are we not supposed to do it? <laughs> I mean, the reality is, Gumpy, this is like right up your alley. You like singles, right? Lay the, lay the butt down. Lay the butt down. Put the ball in play. Move the boys around, Jet. Jeez, I wasn't please. talking about singles like that. But anyway, oh, there are going to be more singles. Oh. <laughs> there are going to be... 
there are absolutely going to be more singles, balls that land in right field, balls hit up the middle. Honestly, guys, what this is, it's a return to 1970s and 1980s baseball. And no. I, I think Major League Baseball has been... Pat? Sorry about it. I name you we're playing baseball. <laughs> no, you're not. Oh! <laughs> Let's go! Ty, how does it feel to have the little sister of spending in New York baseball? Oh, 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 oh shit! Oh, yes. oh, Jet, shit. Jet oh, do not burn. do not be naive, okay? The fucking Mets choked last year in the playoffs. You know they did. Here, here's the thing. They're wearing buzzers. Where if the like pitch clock goes off, oh, whoa, whoa. They, <laughs> they never wore. Them. Remember, <laughs> Jet? Oh, they did. They did not. Jet did. said all the reporting in research, no buzzers were okay. ever on the Astros. Right, Jet? Correct. Okay. Buzzers I on Alex. Ty, you, Ty, you really want to believe that, don't you? No, you were the one who said that. Altuve had the exoskeleton. Allegedly. Oh, allegedly. Yeah, allegedly. you did. You get sued. That's defamation. If I know it, that's defamation. Yeah. I didn't say him. it. Jet said it. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. Sorry, Jet. I saw Machoya signed for 15 years, $400 million or something yep. like that. That's yeah. good. That's a Jet passing news break. Yeah, it was a lot of money. Endeavors. What's wrong, Jet? We say something that you didn't like? Yeah, what's going what's on? What's going on? Do we have no, the, here's No, here's the problem. There are 10 people in there, and I don't want to, like, trample over anybody. And Jet, you're uh, our guest. Got to, everyone's got good Oh, baseball Jet, you're trample. our guest, Jet. Yeah. Trample the Jets, Jet. Yes, Jet, trample. you're the guy. Fucking brrr, yeah. You're yeah. taking yeah. that thing off, Fucking Jet. Fucking target Airstrike, Jet. Strike, you're on Jet. the runway, Jet. Fucking go. Yeah. Pat, do you care about Manny Machado signing a deal? No. It's a big deal. <laughs> I saw you yeah, tweet it, though. I, didn't think so. I, saw you, I saw you tweet it, though, and I knew it was a big deal. But, yeah, those guys are all good, and then there's me. Got to but you wouldn't know looking from that picture. No, you no. look the part. This is like the guy who dresses the best at the golf course. Bingo. Like, yeah. you got a great fit right there. I need you can tell more. the yellow pants is the best, right? I don't know. I red, red pants. pants. Red, red pants. pants. Like yeah, yeah. Red pants is, is he's, the guy. He's, he's Austrian. He knows what's going okay. on. Of oh, course. He how, is. About, how about great mm-hmm. pants on the left there? He looks pretty comfortable on his yeah, skis. He's good lean. Good. Yeah. Where's he from? Italy? <laughs> he is, I'm sure his ancestors are from Italy. Why okay. do you say that? No, oh, he said Austria. I figured this was a very well rounded. What's he group. saying? So I just guessed it. I mean, I was going to guess a couple of them, but. Nick, no, go, go ahead. I'm sure they would be happy to hear. He's, uh, you, know. Let me see. you know what? The, it's too blurry. It's too distinct. I yeah, can't really. It's yeah, a little yeah. too pixelated. Yeah. Actually, you know, right next to you, that could be. That guy's German. Swedish, German. Yeah. yeah. For sure. And then uh, I think yellow pants is probably. Scottish, Scottish yellow pants. Okay, okay that's, that's where we're I was headed. Just about the Irish, 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 Irish in the middle, and then just regular American dudes on the other. Okay, shout out to America, really holding it together there at the end. You watched a little stand up too. I did. What's that guy's name? Nate Bargatz. Nate Garbatz. And. <laughs> and. What else? Who's that other guy you watched? Yeah, loved him. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Donald Trump. Just say it. That was not saying up. <laughs> oh, I'm not a DT guy. Uh, who, 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 who are you? Who are you for? DS guy. Obviously, we know fucking two-time <laughs> graduate of an Ivy League school. Okay, served in the military. Just took back control of his entire state. All right. I believe he broke some news. Talking about cover Tony, did Ron DeSantis, our future president. All right. Yeah. Specifically I do. you, mm-hmm. but I do respect it. I do appreciate it. We'll continue to be a forum for conversation. Let Tiger make Amen. his jokes. Okay. In a, in a forum for thoughts. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? That's what we'll con- do. <laughs> What did he say? I did see you fire that tweet off. How good did Tone feel whenever he fired that tweet off? Went to my wife, went to my mom. They agree with me. They're both women. Boom. I asked my baby, too. She was cool with it as well. (laughs) (laughs) You got all generations. Yep. Uh, There's people pissed about that, bro. Yeah. There's people real mad about Tiger doing that. Just juvenile. Just sexist juvenile jokes. Oh, I was like, what the hell are we talking about? Yeah, when he passed the old tampon. Tampon, Yeah. yeah, yeah. We're well, not allowed to have friends, uh, have fun with your friends. So if, if you think that you can, then you should just sh- shut up and sit down. <laughs> and if you want to do it on a golf course, then you should have your hands cut off and you'll never be able to play golf again. I was confused by the, but I'm not a woman, I guess. So I don't yeah, yeah but I pulled them. <laughs> three out 100% of, three. of the people yeah, that I pulled, that's right. which we do have to keep an eye on for polls. Mm-hmm. That's like one of the things you, uh, yeah, here's Tones. Love you, Tiger Woods. <laughs> Everyone offended stinks. There's no way real people were offended. Only fake Twitter offended, <laughs> which is also a problem. Yeah. Because there's a lot of people that just grandstand on the internet, but then they probably live much worse in real life. Or don't care. Never saw it. Just saw that, you know, it's like, oh, people are pissed about this. I might as well weigh in. I'm pissed too, actually, now that I come to think of it. Me too. Yeah. Fuck this really? shit. This is bullshit. Sorry, guys. What? 
I'm not, and I think you guys are both <laughs> dumb for thinking that way. Wow. Well, you're wrong forever. Nope, I'm right. No. Yeah. You're a bad person. Well, like, do you think people would have been I'm okay saying. with it if Tiger would have... We're about to do a political debate real quick. <laughs> we were right in the middle of it, but go on. If Tiger would have walked by and been like, hey, Justin, you're a fucking pussy. <laughs> do you think, do you think people would have hated that? Or was so it just mad. because the yeah. tampon came so out? So mad. <laughs> So mad, dude. This is what Boston <laughs> Connor asks self-made billionaire owner of the Phoenix National Club, not the home okay. of the Waste Management yeah. Tournament. After everything with, you know, the golf course, how did the Waste Management and getting people there for, you know, like tour events happen? What? He said Arizona's become a home for golf. Yeah. Have you been a part of that whole build out and how have you been able to feel it, especially with how big this Waste Management Tournament has become in the PGA. Well, but, you know, I, I, I haven't done much with the Waste Management. <laughs> Although I will tell you, it is incredibly good for us. Uh, He's not Valley looking at me here, by the way. Yeah, He's no, looking no. at someone else. He, he did look at me again. Good. And uh, that is at Scottsdale <laughs> National. That's our busiest time of year. Mm -hmm. And a lot of our members are all over there. But, uh, you know, I'm... Um, Golf's you know, huge, I, I would only I would only go over there if I was chasing women. <laughs> and, uh, I'm great answer, Connor. Yeah. Yeah. Great answer. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's only the second time people have seen it. Oh, my God, bro. What, 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 what is it? What is it? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> like I would have got up and fucking ragged yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah and for the pissed. record, by the way, Gary V. If Gary's acting like he's not going to feel like he won the Super Bowl if the Jets ever All right, won let's the run Super that clip. Bowl. So what he's talking about. I would like, yeah, yeah, let's dive into this because Gary's the right, one that. You had quite a fucking yeah, week. Yeah, yeah, I couldn't speak for the first half of it, too. A.J. Hawk. Yeah. 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 Asked you to have sex with their wife on this cruise All ship. Right. No old guy reached his hand down my pants and tried to grab my <laughs> dong like it happened to Whoa. you. Guys. So I don't know what cruises you're oh, going man. on. There may be specific cruises that. just for that, but the Buckeye cruise is not one of those from what I have seen. Congratulations on not getting, you know, solicited to do. Yeah, I was neither the cuck or the cucky, I guess, right? Okay, thanks for clearing that up. All right. Okay. Well, well, there yep. no, Thank you. No cucks involved. Okay, no cucks about it. The Ohio State cruise. Yep. If you would like to wear a mask still, do whatever makes you happy. Do whatever makes you happy. We're, but I, I think there is a large portion of society. Don't let Tony but see. But the New York it. Times said, "Don't do shit." Bingo. Well, and, and then, we, that's pretty. They're they're like an important one, right? Yeah, and they're we know like what side they lean to as well. Whoa! What does that even Ski, mean? I'm what just is saying. Your, what is your that, deal? It's, it's not like you know. OA, OAN or whatever the hell it's called. How come, how come Tone and Connor? <laughs> These guys just can't, just what? can't, you know. They get so excited. Talking dude. about the news. The this dude up. literally only knows one human in politics. That's right. And who's that one True. human? Who's that True. one human? That is the future president of the United States of America, Governor Ron DeSantis. And for those of you that knew the show, he watched Yellowstone and became this person. Yeah. Then he learned That's about right. it. That's right. <laughs> uh, anyways, hey, we're, mass on that boat? Mass on that boat? Mass like Catholic Church? Yes. <laughs> no. It, were no, they giving no. the Eucharist out? Yeah. <laughs> what? What do you mean? <laughs> what? Masks. You Mask know what I mean? with a K. Uh, there's some people wearing masks every once in a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah them overboard, right? I think that's just no, but I th no. I no, think that's, I don't care. I think that's gonna be normal now. We just yeah. that just needs yeah. to be. Uh, sure. It's the way it is. And by the way, I think they're to us much nicer now too. You know what I mean? Like, I yeah. feel like yeah, yeah, yeah. I had a couple conversations with some people that were whenever I was in the middle of my travels for um, uh, the vacation or whatever. Mm -hmm. And very kind. Then he did Brock Purdy, too, I believe. Okay. So, which I read an interesting, interesting report about. What? You know how he still had the inflammation or whatever? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because he was still using his right arm and right elbow to hold his massive penis when he was taking okay. a piss. Could be. That, so then they switched. that was reported? Yeah, he switched to his left hand, and now it's, the swelling is going to go down so he can have that surgery. Wait till reported. you see how he's able to throw with his left hand if that's the work he's been putting in. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? For what? That's like two months now at this point. Yeah. Is that, that, is that, is that, put that out? I mean, what the fuck? The swelling's been going on since, you know, the play. Ice your fucking elbow, dude. Jesus Christ. I don't think that was reported by Rap Sheet Schefter or any other of the insiders, AJ. When I moved from center to guard, I thought it was I thought it was easier because I'm so used to having a guy right on my face. I got, a, I got, a, I got a snap and block somebody yeah, he just initially comes, with my yeah. hand. So he, comes, right so he comes right on your face there when right. you're at center? Just, just something. Just... just Comes right on it, right? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, geez. What are you talking about? Jeez. Damn. 
Uh, you tell me, you sickos. You're going to end up on Jimmy Kimmel. We're talking about football, dude. Hey. Get your head out of the gutter over there. What are you talking about? So, Sonny, oh. you're right here. You got you got guy ready to just come right yeah, here on your face. Your coming all over. <laughs> right? Yeah, but I think, I think that's the biggest thing. <laughs> True, <laughs> yeah. You stand up, you suck them up easy. That's a good stance right there. That's a good flat back. That is. Huh? You see that? That's a good flat back stance right there. Way! Way, huh? That's a good looking stance. <laughs> oh, shit! <laughs> oh. Go, Zero. No! no. Oh, you guys gotta oh, catch that. Oh! Uh, oh. Bill, juice and paper towels. <laughs> What was it? It's Coke Zero. Oh! Yeah. Dale Jr. and Take went down as no! well. Oh, no! Unbelievable. That's all the drink. Not Holy. three. I tried to... Th in my head, by the way, that ball snapped right here no, to your was, head. It would have been perfect yeah. if I was slid over. I was fucking aligning my uh, my slot receiver. Come on, Tony. Get it together. That's on me. I apologize for spilling the Coke Zero, too. I know those are oh, a yeah. dime a dozen. Yeah. Uh -huh. Liquid gold. Yeah, they, and they don't have to give anything up, obviously, because Jimmy will be yeah. a free agent. Let's talk about the other two teams you chatted about. What you? What is it? What happened? I have no more coffee. Oh no! Oh jeez! Oh, Rappy want coffee. <laughs> Rappy need eggs. coffee. What's so, what's so what's June buzzer? doing over so there? Yeah, buzzer where your family brings coffee yeah, like down a, for you. Electric collar. Uh, it, you know the TV world is weird, and I know you know this. Please when you're say. at events like the combine for instance and you're chained in you have to stay in an area people are constantly like can i get you something can i get you coffee i know you can't leave here says we'll get you something yep. and then i come home and i'm like hey leah can i get coffee and she'll look at me like i have like Keurig. six toes She's like yeah you know where the kitchen is buddy yeah Keurig is right do you? you just put the cup in yeah. Boom. Like, press the size make sure you have the cup in there right. mm. yeah you network right. folks are really spoiled Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Oh, it's again. I got a chance to experience that with game day. It's awesome. Joining us now is a guy who can break every piece of information in every news article the NFL has moments after exiting our show every fucking time. Yep. Ian Rappaport. Hi, guys. Ian. You know... I'll say this. With all apologies to my great sources, I just wanted to make sure I'm available to the people to explain what the Derek Carr numbers actually mean. Thank you for being such a hero, Ian. Honestly, you know what? You're right. Hardest parts probably just putting the dirt in if you want dirt. Don't need dirt. Bye, dirt. dirt. For what? <laughs> Jordan Davis. I've been listening to a lot of his songs. Yeah? Got bangers. He's up for best lyrics or something like that. Makes sense. Okay. The CMAs? I think so. Let's go. Good for him. The buy dirt's a banger. Let's wait till he wins. Good, good I don't call. want to celebrate too early. Good call. Buy dirt's a banger. It is a banger. How about next thing you know? Have you heard that one? No, I just went through his top five. Is that in the top five? Yeah. yeah next know. thing you know is another one. It's like, mm -hmm. next thing you know, you're hearing that. Next thing you know, you're hearing that. Next thing you know. It's like an emotional. It's like, nice. uh, like have a baby. Yeah, like you meet, you yeah. get married, have a baby, oh, baby cool. joins. Like Next thing you know, you're dead. What's your problem, AJ? It sounded very condescending. I'm dead serious. I'm, it's cool. I'm not sure exactly what's going on, but it sounds cool. Uh, it sounds like you're taking yeah. some liberties that I don't appreciate here, pal, with how you're taking it. You're a prick. It's got a I don't know much about this artist, but sounds great. Joining us live from an attic in Ohio is Amanda's college football national champion, Super Bowl champion, Ryder Cup champion. Number five overall. Ooh, huh. Oh, huh. Oh, 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 shit. Yikes. Oh, shit. Ladies and gentlemen, COVID survivor AJ Hawk. Yeah. Number five overall pick. That was old CBA, too. Oh, oh my, my God. God. We're Come, so rich. Oh, so my. So rich. Mostly, num shit. mostly number two. We found that out. Yeah. 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 Hey, lied to. Mm -hmm. Absolutely lied to. AJ, good What's to see up, you. What's up, Pac? How's it going, Pac? What's up, AJ? Man, good to see you. Good to see Pac on stage there. Diggs, how you doing across there? You, you got any good things in today with Pac on the stage? What are you talking? Why are you What's trying that? to divert yeah, this? Yeah, what are you doing? You're that? wealthy. We Diggs get it. I oh, Diggs uh, to get, like, worried. Sometimes Diggs gets worried to, to like, jump in or chime in at times. No, that is not the case. Weird. I don't think he gets worried at all. I don't, know, I don't know what your problem is. Okay, you're still glowing from the Buckeye, no <laughs> cuckeye cruise. Of course. And we appreciate <laughs> you joining us here. Pac, what do you think about whenever you saw the face this man? Because it's, like it's like a home plate. You yep. know what I mean? It's, it, it's the largest jawline of all time and then when you see it in real life it is like a bobblehead but his body is proportional yeah, yeah. huge yeah, dog exactly. just keeps going just ohio state led. what were your thoughts whenever you seen uh, aj man me and aj click that's my boy we would have weirdly awkward good conversations yeah well, yeah, well that's um, it yeah. yeah that's, that's that that's big AJ. brain yeah. that's Probably, it. <laughs> I, I actually, some of the weirdest things he, <laughs> but um yeah me and aj always been good man i always say he's one of 
the top teammates I ever had, but unbelievable great person. Yeah, well, it's nice to know you both uh, had a great time sharing a locker room and a team. That was a good year for you guys too, right? Yeah. Oh, we yeah. had success that year. Oh, yeah. For a while. Until that one last yeah. game. Andy was on like MVP at a pace. Andy yeah. was basically like one of the top MVP guys, and then he what, made a tackle on a pick and broke his wrist or thumb or something. Was it 11 wins that year, 12? I think uh, 11, that 11 a, and 5, I, I think. No, we won eight eight straight, and I think we was 12, 12 wins. You won the division, right? Andy yeah. Dalton had 10-plus wins for, like, yeah. this that came up, like, six or seven straight years yeah. or something. And you guys ended Antonio Brown's brain that game. Jeez. <laughs> what? No, that was James well, No, Harrison that was James Harrison. Harrison. That, yeah. Hey, we all know. Oh, it wasn't Vontaze. We all know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 It, wasn't, it wasn't Vontaze, yeah. That is, hey. That was, that was awesome. awesome. Yeah. That Still awesome. got it. Yeah. Still got it. <laughs> Bill works out here and at another gym. I was told from Bill that he felt awkward coming in here at night when he needs to get that second or third workout oh, come in. Come on, Bill. So he went to a 24-hour place, I believe. Right? Isn't that a 24-hour place? Oh, yeah. He, the video that just got ran here about WrestleMania season and wrestling, Rip Rogers actually works out at Bailey McComas' gym. Oh, right. that explains So Bill lot. and Rip at the same gym, those weights are so fucked, dude. Oh, my God. Bill. So <laughs> fucked, dude. Oh. Bill said, too, like any place that's 24 hours is a great spot for victims. I mean, you can sure. get people coming Whoa. out at any this time. Target-rich environment. Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah it, it, it's not new, Bill, to go through that camera roll and see what else he's taking. He said he had to lift there. because all <laughs> of his victims were getting away too easily. So he had to get more shots. All right, yeah, okay. Got all right. Hold on to Bill, him. Bill, hey, Bill, you deserve Scout, Bill. Bill, good self scout. Yeah, smart. Bill, this is all bullshit. Ignore these guys, Bill. Bill Allegedly. Hey, look, these allegedly. guys. What are you talking about? I see you I falling underneath the table. Never. <laughs> or would never. <laughs> Pack likes it. Pack of crazy. He's only done yeah. this guy for a couple yeah, hours. Yeah, a guy would kill people, right? Uh, oh, talks man. to tables here at Boston Connor. <laughs> Ty Schmidt. One half of the hammer. Dad. Cowboys Tone Diggs is here. Pac Man Jones is here. And I baby Pac. Hey. Hey. What, ab what about Bill Driver Tyler? What's that? Tell me about this. What's that? What's that? He's, I think he's what? curious as to how we got to build murdering people yeah. and cutting oh. throats. Okay, so that's Good AJ question. Hawk right there. Great question out of you. Honestly, I don't know. So Did you see him? Did you yeah. see him? Did you his get a good view, look at him? His view, the, the way he looks certainly <laughs> does feed into a potential story or two yeah. that you could think of in your mind. He's from, sh in, I want to say the place. He's from a place in Indiana yeah, that only is like. One. I'm sure there's some stories that have come yeah. out of there that are not like the great. Serial killers are just like what? Like serial killers come from there? Mixture. I, you do some history on <laughs> old Indiana. Yeah, it's like the past. <laughs> yeah. You got a spotted past, you, if you, you will. Do, you could do your own history. And then there was this one time where Bill, uh, I thought it was somebody else's. Nick told me to go get something out of his backpack. Yep. And I oh, went into no. a backpack. It was not. It was a head. Nick's, what? No, a couple it was just like, it was like, a, like ten oh. knives. Yeah, it was a throw. He had a, a ninja stars in <laughs> yep, there. Two had blocks. a couple of knives and a, whole, a couple of like, ears. Uh, I'm like, holy fuck! <laughs> yeah. What is going on here? And then obviously everybody kind of took that and just kind of run with it. And Whoa. Bill has never, ever really said. Guys, that's not true. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, that's a good point. Also, there was that one time in Orlando during fight week where he was like, hey, I think it'd be funny if I took these photos and I was standing behind A.J. Hawk and you guys would take them for me and I'd just You're be right. looking lurking. at him. Yeah, lurking yeah. with a knife in his yep. hand. This is a new bill, though. You met a new bill. This is a brand new bill. That's yeah. right. I don't know that Bill y'all talking about. Bingo. Exactly. Bingo. Oh, That's what I'm talking about. That's yet. what I'm trying to say. Bill I met was a great dude. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Great yeah. guy. Anime he Bill. Is. He is. He is. Mm -hmm. so you hear this? Yeah. Yeah. Serial killers are personable. We're not saying he's a bad No, dude. I've been seeing yeah. a lot of docs. They're not. They're personable to people who are like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Bondi. Psy psychopaths are very good at you know, ingratiate themselves with people. Correct. Yeah, but you would you know. Like, hey, we're all we're all on the same team here, guys. For Aaron so, Rodgers, there are any number of appendages of mine that you could remove. <laughs> we're was, not limited to said. the pinky toe. Oh, oh, you're talking about. I don't know that I'm quite willing to go that far, but it's negotiable. <laughs> I heard Greeny. He said he cut his meat off. For yeah. Aaron to <laughs> yes. Pretty much. Essentially, he, he woke up and he didn't know it was taken. Oh no, I would know right away. I think. Uh, that's a die hard fan, man. You know who is still alive, though? I was surprised to see. Sister Jean. Okay, saw her yesterday. Yeah. <laughs> Turns need, out she's crushing it. Don't show that picture, Sister it did, it, Look, I, I had no idea she was still looking like a spring chicken. All right, let's get to a break on that note. Sister Jean's still doing 103 years old. Yeah. You won't even fucking be around no, at I, 103. No way. Show your respect for Sister I, Jean. I did. I, I, I tweeted out yesterday. Come on now. Look at Sister Jean. She looks great. She's 103. Boom. She does look good. Yeah, her eyes are open. Ooh. 
Look at that. That, See, oh, that's hold on. Why, that's, 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 that's sister okay. Jean. Okay. okay. That's sister Jean. Yeah, with eight staples. Dude, could you imagine being a flight. 103 years old? Nope. AJ, it was an expensive flight, okay? We Jeez. don't need to bring that up right now. We're talking about... The Lord's paying Who's for that Who's paying flight. for that? The Lord. Yeah. Who cares? Sister Sister Jean. She's a sister. It's a private Jasper. flight. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, who cares, yeah. though? That's her from eight years ago going she to the AJ tournament. Sister yeah. Jean's she does not care about the environment. It. She's in a G4 or a G5, too. Yeah. She's yeah. The window. That's 75 years old. Yeah. I think she's probably saved a couple shekels over the years. She's, she can afford it. Dude, could yeah. you imagine being 103 years old and still having energy to do something? Come on. Oh, yeah. She I looks mean, like she's got plenty of energy, huh? She does. She's right on there. a play. Oh, yeah. Go to, the, go to her she's at the game. Look. What's she wow. doing? She's focused. What was this after she led 18 chance? She's in the middle of a hiccup. She, she's in the middle of. It. Ty actually said yesterday this is after her fifteenth beer, but. <laughs> <laughs> is that what what makes sense. AJ, is that what you dressed up for? Is Halloween? All right, we need to, we Please, need not get on. into Halloween costumes, especially coming from your mouth. Yeah. With yeah, what yeah. we're in the middle of. Anyway, well, Sister Jean, one hundred and three years old, still alive. Shout out. Way to go, Sister. Great March Madness story. Every single. Are they gonna make it in the tournament? No, no actually, no, now lost, yeah. that's the thing. Every single oh, team no. going forward has a lot of pressure. Yeah, this is March Madness time, and Sister Jean has been a great story of March Madness. Thank so we you. appreciate her. Yes. Love you, Sister Jean. Commitment to the Love you, Sister. Love you, Jean. And being 103 years old, that photo will obviously hit the internet, and the internet's going to do what the internet's going to do. Of course, I believe Wale was the one that said, the internet's going to let their jokes fly. Yep. we got to keep it moving. Turns out Regis and Dick Clark, both very dead. Yep. Yeah. We'd like to thank them for their service to television and to media. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think hour three should be on the other side. Started eight for Brady last night. Oh, that's oh. right. So you started it, so you didn't get through it. Well, it was uh, Dude, laughing too hard. Had to pause it. Yeah, Save it for stomach today. hurt. Yep, I know. I'll say I this. Get it. I will say this. Yeah, Sally Fields stole the show. I don't know which one Sally Fields. Okay, but the she's the funny one. One that stole the show. You know. The, well, that's the thing that I'm saying here. <laughs> they all steal the show. I thought it was a pretty good movie. You're saying yeah. Jack Vaughn stole the show. It was put on. Maybe Lily Tomlin. Okay, I don't know which one's which, and that is 100 percent on me. And I think maybe my mom. Like, I think she should mm -hmm. probably introduce yeah. me to some of these people at some point. Sure. But I'm not 100% sure she was in to what they were. Or I wasn't in the house enough. I wasn't in the house enough to know what it was. I didn't know who any of the ladies were. Mm -hmm. Went into it with an open mind. Also, with a plan to fall asleep. Okay. okay. A plan to fall asleep. I'm putting this on to fall asleep. Yeah. Not a bad movie. Hey, I look. could see how people would enjoy it. Mm -hmm. Obviously, I am not the demographic. Well, but I could see how people would enjoy the movie if that mm -hmm. made sense. Yeah. Does that make sense? Oh, yeah. yeah absolutely. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. It wasn't like, oh, I'm going to watch it. Like, I'm not. There's no way I'm running it back. Sure. Okay. You know, I kind of got it. I'm not going to finish it. Right. But I don't watch a lot of movies. Yeah. So people that are listening to this, like, that, I am not a, I am a sports stooge, mm -hmm. bro. Like, this is literally, this is what I am at all times. Mm hmm but I thought it was good. I thought it was good. I think my wife enjoyed it. There you go. Okay. I think she enjoyed it a lot. Yeah. And I fell asleep like a gentleman at a good part nice. where it seems like I got it figured out. Yep. Yeah. No they were big fans of Tom, though. Brought them all together. Yeah, huge fan. True story. They were not football fans. No. You'll recognize Sally. She's far right. She was the wife uh, and Mrs. Doubtfire. Was one of those. Sally crushes it, I will yep. say. Yeah, yeah, she absolutely. All of them have their. Um, hey. Certified fresh for a reason. They all have like their own individual yeah, opportunities yeah. mm -hmm. to like do their, the do their thing. Yeah, that's why whenever you said to start the show, I'm like, I think they all kind of. I'm biased. Oh, yeah. just because you're fandom. Yeah. Do you know any of those ladies up Definitely there? Definitely didn't watch that. Okay. Yeah, so, I mean, usually I would, I, you know, I'd ask some questions. I go along with it. I know you thought that movie fucking sucked. Okay. I'm not What's your deal? I'm not What's messing this guy's around. Wrong? Come today. on. And, and how many times for? have you heard this sentence? I thought it was a good movie. I fell asleep during it, but I thought it was a good movie. With that, no, you I never made that happen. That. That's literally what I'm doing. That That's movie my life. Fucking sucked. No, okay. whoa, whoa, you watched whoa. it. Whoa. Yeah, I did. You watched the whole thing. Something must have changed then after the part that I watched. Nothing changed. I was it was good. <laughs> that movie has been dog shit since it was being what made. What is your problem? What is wrong dog with shit you? now. 89% of people that watch this thing say, yup. Yep, okay. And that's Boom. only 89% of people that opt to take the poll. That's true. Which yeah. is a Look at that, though. 2,500 plus. plus verified rating. Do you know how many of those people uh, have the TB12 method? And do you know how many of those people work for that company that took a PMP loan? Oh, you didn't the... like how much it was about. Whoa. Oh, it makes sense to me why you hated it. No, I didn't As like a Belichick it. Guy, mm. It is quite a. Uh, he spit on Sister Jean yesterday. Now he's talking trash on Rita Marino uh, and boy, Sally Field. You, you it's uh, it's becoming a problem. You didn't hear what I said about Sister you Jean. You hate old ladies. I said I thought she looks great. 
Now you forced it into the conversation. Yeah, I know. We're talking about old people. Yeah, you forced it. We're talking about old people. Yeah, and but the that, first person that came to my mind was Sister Jean looking great. Yeah, but that particular photo obviously made it into all of our lives while we were all around each other. Yeah. And it felt like we all decided, like, we're not doing Sister Jean like that. No. I missed that. And miss then that. all of a sudden, while we're having a conversation, and then his brain, shh. Yeah, exactly. jackpot. Yep. I, didn't, mm -hmm. I I must have missed right, that. See, and now, and now we got to do it again. See, look, Enough. It's she's 103. I didn't do this. She looks good. Years old. I think she looks good. Don't worry about that now, AJ. He's oh, at the 15. Don't. He's at the 10. He's at the 5. Oh, no. Oh, oh, toilet. Oh, no. in there. What happened? I was out of nowhere, too. I believe Ty, uh, I believe Ty was close to doing what Connor did to his apartment toilet yeah, just a few weeks back right mm -hmm. there on the stage, I believe. I've what happened to your toilet, Con? I, I put my pants. I don't know if I was here for that. Oh, no, you oh, weren't. No, oh, I I I oh. Let's go, Debbie on Long Island. Debbie, what is the... Oh, 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 what is the recommended daily amount of water intake for a human being? Oh, I know this one. In ounces? I'm going to go with uh, 64 ounces a day. Oh, you can say a sentence. You got four seconds about ounces in your weight. Oh, you're out of time. Uh, so, sorry, Debbie. I'm sorry. Oh, 64 yeah. ounces. Debbie, it was an honor to meet you, honestly, and chat with you. Ty, what Love was the answer? Love you guys. Love you too, Debbie. It uh, it is sixty four fluid ounces. So I don't know if you oh, want. No, to she's right. Yeah, 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 she's right. Oh yeah, hundred yeah. percent right, Debbie. 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 Hold on, TB twelve told me I got to drink like for my body weight. I thought that was like a, for every, for however much you weigh, you have to have ounces of water or something, or half the amount yeah, of ounces it, of water. Exactly. It's weird, right? Lied. Because if you sell bottles that are you know based on how much you weigh, then you can sell more bottles if you're telling people you have to drink that much. Okay, so you're saying the hydration conversation is one that's maybe been worked and pried at a little yeah. bit yep. since yeah. the beginning of it all, but the science is 64 yeah. fluid ounces? Eight, eight ounce glasses of water is what the... Debbie! Yeah. Debbie! Woo! The foul Thanks, queen! Guys. Hell yeah, <laughs> Debbie. That was awesome. I thought you were wrong. I thought that was way wrong. Me oh, yeah. too. I would have got that one wrong. Because I thought it was a fuck. I thought it was like 120. Yeah, boom. Yeah. There yeah, it is. Frick. Yeah, we get it, dude. You like water. <laughs> is that real? Eight cups <laughs> a day. Picture? Yep. Yep. We get it, dude. Yeah, sweet. <laughs> this fucking guy. I don't know. I've been doing it all wrong. I've been hydrating the shit out of myself. Not as much as that guy, though. No. Tom Brady two lives off of hydrating. What's that, pal? He needs two hands for that thing. Could you imagine strapping that to your waist? Like, how do you? Oh. I've always tried. Debbie, congratulations. Thank you, boys. We appreciate you, Debbie. Take care, Fowl. Um, were you a carry a jug of water guy around? No. Yes, yeah. you were. Yeah, it was. Really? No, absolutely not. I drink a ton of water, but I've never, I've never, I guess, been serious and carried a jug of water around. I've only done it sarcastically. I don't know how people do it. Like, honestly, I don't know how. Pain in the ass. Gallon Just drink jug. water. Yeah, I don't, like, the, I've seen people Tell that do me, yeah, it. Yeah, it's like, hey, we, know, we get it, bud. You do CrossFit. We get it. That's yeah. <laughs> or a bodybuilder, right? Milk jug. Yeah, it's like pretty easy. Yeah. Like the bodybuilders, you look at it, you're like, all right, that's literally a part of the job. Mm -hmm. That's actually yeah. a part of the job. <laughs> like everything like that. Everything else, I get very confused about just the – because they say, well, it's got a latch. I'm hooking that fucker up like uh, – Pull like, my pants down? Like right here, and that's just – what? Yeah, I don't know. I have no idea what you're supposed to do with it. Put it on your belt? What? Yeah. No. <laughs> Wearing it sarcastically is the like to AJ's point. Like if you're if you get a gallon jug and then you start writing on it like hard work plus dedication yeah. equals yes. success. Yep. Like that's what we would do in high school because we would have to do it. So we might as well make a joke and a mockery out of this thing. <laughs> Y'all should see this smile on me right now, he said. Could have took a picture. I mean, a lot of. Yeah. If he's able to tweet, <laughs> right. if he was able to tweet from the phone that he's using, probably able to go ahead and also send a photo. Saint Bartholomew. Do you know this place? Bartholomew. Saint Bart's. Saint Bart's. Saint Bart's? Saint Bart's? Yeah. Yeah. I've never been. Never been either. Where is it? AJ. I assume Saint Bart's. I don't know where. Saint Bart's has got to be one of those islands. Virgin Island area. Is that where you hang out? I don't down there somewhere. There's islands. I don't know what's the Virgin Islands and what's not. Not the one you've been on. <laughs> you know the area? What is that where is that where you guys go? You Are you trying to say that's where Epstein's spot is? A little thing. Oh! Oh! 
It's for Jeez. sale. I thought, hey, you have a large, you have a big bank account. It's for sale. This is or disgusting. I, I am so yeah. sick. Yeah. Wrong with yeah. you. I just wanted to know where Gary Wilson was because if he was there and he wasn't able to smile, like I'd like, That's I'm not, not going. Yeah, I'm trapped? not going. Okay, I'm not going if he's not smiling. Seems like he's having an absolute blast right now. Is that even a real island? St. Lucia, St. Bart's. I've definitely heard of it. Yeah, right by sure. St. Kitts. You guys mm -hmm. seem a lot more excited than you were out in uh, wherever we were when you went to that Posner concert. Bingo. Whoa, Bingo. Whoa, That's whoa. what I'm talking about. Completely, completely yes. different vibes and energy right now. Could you could you fathom if fucking Blake Shelton played at that ESPN oh, Super Bowl party? Oh, place would have blown up. Those two names shouldn't be in the same sentence. No, exactly. I, I agree. He did that. No, no, Sorry. I know. But Foxy, now we know Foxy it. Would put Posner, Posner above, would have been better at yeah. the, that concert Foxy. and ESPN I knew concert. No offense to Blake. I knew that was <laughs> Don't you mark. even, I don't even know what you're talking was, about. Uh, Can we drop the gimmick now? I mean, we were doing the they, Not a gimmick. Yes. Because me and Connor both said, hey, this guy sucks. I, I didn't go. I was a little tuned up, but I didn't go. And when I heard, oh, I miss Posner. Great. Who cares? I don't Boom. give a shit. What is your problem? What's your deal? We drop the gimmick. No. Okay. What's wrong with that? You weren't there, Blake, Ty. Blake Shelton is a showman. Yes, he okay. is. He's a maestro. He's a master right. of Posner the crap. Right. You're saying Posner's not a showman? Thank you, Nick. Hold on. After watching Posner, he, what Posner did have control over some of the audience. All of it. But what he was trying to do to the audience was like the complete opposite of what we're trying to do. We're trying to have a good time. He's Sit like, down. get down. <laughs> get down. Blake Shelton was the complete opposite. Blake Shelton was like, hey, let's have a good time tonight. Thing was called. And that's all that needed to be said. It was like the largest honky tonk in Indiana. That's pretty right. much how they viewed it. We're talking about, oh. oh, my God. We're getting after it in there. So much different vibe than Posner. Foxy, you need to watch your mouth. Yeah. I mean, okay. 1A, 1B. Let's put it that way. I'm, no. Yeah. No, Foxy. no, no. Yeah. I like Posner. I have been positive on the Posner. With that being said, I've seen Posner live now. I've seen Blake Shelton live now. If if Blake's going to be 1A, Posner might be around 250, 230. Thank you. <laughs> when you're talking about two different fucking... Because remember, the goddamn Lee Corso on the... Uh, on the sax, yeah. On the sax <laughs> was, was a massive We're part of the program. The yes. Sax. Blake was just, there was one point, Blake was just him, his guitar, and a spotlight. Well, how's Blake's social media game? Because I know it's not up to Posner. Thousand times better than no! Posner. Yeah, that's how he got on TV. Armageddon. Yeah, he's actually, yeah. that's that's why he is in there. So, once again, if we want to do a ranking system, if Blake Shelton's social media is 1A, <laughs> yeah. Don't do Posner's it. down about 150. No. Yeah. Let's be honest. 160. Okay. Posner yeah. and Shelton, they ain't in the same fucking alphabet. No, no, there ain't no they 1A, are. 1B. You're okay. right. You're 100% right. We need a different language. Exactly. <laughs> Two vast different. Sorry, sorry Posner. Yeah, I mean, I didn't even have to bring this up, and I knew we would get here eventually. First of all, we should probably cut the mic from for, Fox. From Fox. That was so disrespectful. You have no idea what we did with Blake Shelton. No. The night we had yeah. with Blake, the entire state of Indiana had like one of the greatest nights of their life on Saturday because of fucking Blake Shelton. And here you are saying Posner a little bit. He's not, he's not oh, Mike one B. You can't do that, Foxy. We can't have that right now. Did Blake Shelton change your life? Yes. Hundred like percent, bro. It felt like he it. said it was the best because Posner changed my life that to. night. It was the best concert I've ever been to. It was the best concert. Second I've Second best been to. concert you've ever been to. Nope, the best concert I've ever been to. Posner concert doesn't even register top twenty. Well, there, you, there you have it. Was Nothing there, conf else was there confetti? Said. Did confetti fall from the sky in the stadium? No, he had neon lights. Boom. Yeah. Oh, See, worst concert. There, there's not Boom. confetti because, you know, Blake Shelton doesn't have to pump up his crowd. The crowd comes pumped up. Foxy, I, I can't explain to you right now how aggravated I am at you. I wish I could go back there and just squish your brain because you sound like <laughs> such an idiot. Connor has a question for you, Reese. I appreciate you, though. Yeah, Reese, start of the question, but I figure I'll quibble a little myself. Obviously, I know what that means. Are you then going to acquiesce after you quibble? Sure, if I knew how to say that word, I'd throw, you know, a dart at the board, but I actually don't know how it ends really to be. Is it acquiesce with a C? At the I think end? it's Q. Yeah, it's from Pirates of the yeah. Caribbean. Yeah. No, that's, pa that's parlay, Tony. No, you acquiesce their request. Anyways. Anyways. Quibble, minor. Quibble, acquiesce, fuck it. Uh, I was told <laughs> that uh, Duke would stop getting all the good calls, and turns out <laughs> since Coach K left, they're still getting all these bullshit calls, and Duke is still going to be a good team. Is there a chance that we're seeing kind of a new era of college basketball with the teams like acquiesce with the CE? Okay, with it's to with accept, <laughs> comply, or submit tactically or passively, often used oh, look with at that. one or two. 
Yeah, we acquiesced. Yeah. Dude, we, the acquiesced. Whole thing. we acquiesced all the we time. Yes. Those shoes <laughs> yeah, those shoes. You would love those, Connor. They look like ass. Yeah, I would definitely acquiesce some of those shoes. Yeah, you would. Yeah, a- absolutely. <laughs> uh, but are some of the blue blood teams going to acquiesce? Now that I know what it means. Uh, like Kentucky or Villanova for some of these new teams like Houston, Bama. Like, is there a new era of college basketball? And that the Jets and the Packers right now are simply trying to find a package that works for both sides. So who is – it's the Packers and the Jets right now that are working in your eyes? They're trying to figure something out? It hasn't been approached yet, but perhaps that could happen as well. But I can tell you definitively that if Aaron Rodgers is a Jet, he just wasn't there physically yet, and he needed more time. But you're still talking about someone who's 30 – I believe he's 30 years old, right? He didn't have a great year by his standards. Um, I think he missed Kafka last year, who obviously helped Daniel a lot. But I would go, and they got beat by Cincinnati. But that team, upside-wise, I think is still the highest. I, I just think that would be a home run. And he could revitalize himself with a young quarterback who would find him 140 times. Actually. What a scene. <laughs> what, what are we supposed to do? You yeah, know what I mean? He always does this, too. He didn't even mention it. <laughs> nope. How about the one from the side? I think it was a little bit too far. But yeah, I couldn't even see it. Made the point, though. Yeah. yeah. Point got across. And right the one after this, yeah. yeah. Hey, Foxy, that was good work back there. Z- hey, Fox. uh, the chat was Not asking for a camera on the outside of the building. Of uh, the building? <laughs> we were supposed to have that at one point, actually. We were talking about that this mm-hmm. morning. Jordan, what? You know, <laughs> why does he do what he does? I don't know. I don't know why he's so self-deprecating. Yeah, he's like, so, well, you guys are kicking guys me off the show, man. Me, so I guess yeah. I'll just hang up. It's like, show it's bro. Come on. You got a lot going on over here. We're just trying to do our thing. Sorry. Sorry. Fucking NFL free agents are signing. Yeah. Can't just have you on here the whole time. <laughs> I did, in the intro, I let off with, yeah. Rappaport said, can't do it this week. Mm-hmm. Sorry. Yep. I believe ESPN Schefter, other than all the hits, can't do anything really this week. He works his ass off. He, though, does. Right? he does. I do believe he does. And he's a good guy. Bingo. Yeah. That heart. Yeah. Good mm-hmm. guy. And unfortunately. That's what matter. I mean, him and Rapshi are just getting taken out back by Schefter this week. Right? Jesus Christ, really? It's true. I mean, Rapshi coming into the league, I don't freaking know how to do this. This, this shit's so hard. Dude. But it's like, man, just go out there. Who's keeping score? Everybody's keeping score. I'm not. I'm just happy for the news. No, I, I am. Really. Where was the – I wanted to see, like, what the score was. Like, uh, how, Okay, how, okay. Yeah, I know. You wanted to, like, project it. He wanted to bring it up. Mm-hmm. What I'm saying is we don't need to do that. Okay. Okay, let's just let's just be excited that the news is coming. That's right. I, I was With that being said, it does feel like uh, yeah. there's a lot of stuff coming out. Uh, Jeffy is hot from three right now. He is. I and mean, someone needs to stop the bleeding. Yeah, Rapshi can't buy a bucket. What? He had, like, four or five yesterday. That's what are you it. even talking That's about? Right. I, I, see, I don't believe it's true. I'd like to see the score. I'd like, I think Rap might be up. He yeah. might be. Legit. And also, he focused on Instagram a little bit more. He did. He ain't. Well, and that's dumb right there. What are you doing on Instagram? Yeah, what are you doing today? You training in a shipyard? It looks like you're outside taking a break. You're getting lazy? Is he in there? It's just real. It's weird. We see you yeah, and your I legs. See, yeah, you. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh! Let's go, Hedgy! Putting up one. Hey! Is that eight? Yeah, 50? baby. Hey! Hell yeah. Yeah, baby. We got him going. So you just lay down while he hey, works. Hey, can you can you take us in there so I can motivate him a little bit here? Can we give a little motivational speech here? Yeah, 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 yeah. How much? Hey, the paying? boys want to motivate. Uh-oh. Hey, do another do another rep. Do oh, another yeah, rep. Hey, look at this good coaching. Good, yeah, coach. good coaching. Rep. Boys want to motivate you. Go hey, baby, hey, 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 here we go now. Here we go. Oh. Let's go. Good get step. it off of you, AJ. Good job. Bad foot, get it off of you. Ah. Oh. Hey, baby, hey, team. Yeah. Way to go, Bob. Oh. Go. They're paying guards and centers now, Bob. Keep working. Yeah. Huh? Hey, man. They are. They are. We're getting them going. Daniel Jones proved that he has accuracy, right? Remember that dart he threw in the playoff man, game? Man, against every yeah. single Bruce, throw. he was a guy, right? Bruce, he's become a, an absolute guy here. We're, we're talking about Daniel Dimes. Yeah, for sure. He's super, super accurate. And then, obviously, the, the dual threat <laughs> action. Uh, I mean, it's just, you know. Pac-Man does not. Pac-Man does not. It, it's just such accurate. a huge Bruce. upgrade Can over Can he beat you throwing the ball, throwing. Bruce? Yeah, he for sure. throwing the ball? He, he okay. has. I mean, obviously, like, you know, we're talking about 24 points a game, not 42. Are you, right. you going to say the same two games that we went through the last time? Whoa. What happened? Hello, Bruce. The, <laughs> Hello, Bruce. The two games. Are you there? Hello, Bruce. <laughs> <laughs> Which two? I think Which pa- two? I think the one where o- Odell hit the thriller or the other game? Oh! oh. 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 
Bruins. The Ola and Thriller was a good play. <laughs> Great <laughs> celebration, too. Great celebration, too. Listen, just ask, ask Schefter what I text him when he somehow got my number and texted me. You know, I didn't respond to Diana Rossini, I think her name is. Yes, like, Diana. You got my Great work. Well. But, like, I would say the same thing that I told Sheffy. Sheffy, lose my number. Ooh. Nice try. Listen, I'll speak for myself. I'm sure there'll be people that that's that you know have their sources, but the, you know from what I've seen, it's like I had a sheet of paper when I met with the Jets and I said, uh, "Sign these people." And that's not the reality. That's okay. so ridiculous. All right, that sounds good. <laughs> when did AJ know exactly what was going on, and how long has he been lying mm -hmm. to the entire world? If you had to just guess, you know what I mean. I'd say he probably knew last Tuesday what I was oh, thinking. Oh, my yeah. God. Yep. Son of a bitch. Wow. wow. You? We thought so. <laughs> hey, he's a real one, Aaron. Keep him around. Yeah, he's he a real. He, yeah. he, we're talking. We're putting his ass. You he, piece of shit, AJ. <laughs> he didn't lie, though. Hey, he is not lying. We told that. that we're, I, give yeah, you my exactly. said it. I give you my opinions on what I think he's going to do. You know that. Yeah, but then you always, whenever we're gathering around, you have a cigar in your mouth. I don't and know. You're the back of him. You, I never lied. I never lied. I never lied. Wait, the whole, I mean, that is, that is like waiting to happen. I'm talking about like Aaron, like people will not listen to what Aaron said. Instead, oh, they'll no, say. Oh, no, they've already made up their mind. Yeah, exactly. that's what I'm saying. Like that, like, it's like it, everything, bro. What do you mean? We've been living that for, like you always talk about with this whole COVID situation, everything. I'm like, I think people are pretty dead set in their beliefs right yeah. now. They're not like whatever way you feel. There's not a whole lot that can flip you. Yeah, we say that about politics because we've had a couple of political conversations on on this program, and sure. they always seem to go the same way. I'm better human than you are. That's impossible because I've been the greatest human on earth since I've been conceived. No, that's not true at all. You're a fugaze. I'm actually a good person. You're a terrible person. You saying that uh, I am fugaze m makes you a fugaze because that makes you a liar. No, I'm pointing out the obvious. I'm not lying about anything. I'm saying this is how we all feel because it's the truth. I'm a better person than you are. Yeah, but what's obvious to you is a lie, and what's obvious to me is the truth. <laughs> yeah, but what you're talking about being the truth is making us a much worse place. I'm a better human than you are. See, that's impossible because you just saying you're a better human than me makes you a worse human than me. No, that is not accurate at all. You're the fucking worst human that it can ever come across this planet Earth. I hate you. Please don't swear. I hate you. Okay, that's it. I'm, I'm done with this. I'm no, you're not. I'm not. I'm done with this. No, you're not done with late. this. It's too no, late. No, fuck you. It's too late. You lose. I win now. No, you don't win. You never win. Everything you stand for is a loss. I L, 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 nope. L. No, I woke up in one. I only see Ws. All you see is anger and loss. No, you pooped in your underpants. You couldn't even poop this morning. It's L immediately upon Jump Street today for you, pal. You're a loser. You're a bad human. I'm better human than you. I pooped my pants to get the younger voters on my side and guess what? Every single baby in this country is going to vote for me because of it. So that's politics. Mm -hmm. yep. Oh, but Greeny might be out in an apartment, a house. Yeah, he might be yeah. standing with garden shears right now, ready to clip off his Johnson, yeah. too. <laughs> hey, you think that's his method? I don't think he, he didn't say he was definitely going to cut off his dick, right? Dull, no, but dull no. garden shears. He said it was it. negotiable. He said he yeah, might. negotiable. It is negotiable. <laughs> he's going to use a welding torch. <laughs> yeah, because of that, this is probably <laughs> fresh. So it cauterizes the, the immediately. Smart. Yeah, but with him, you better bring extra propane because, well, yeah, yeah. you know, we're talking about yeah, exactly. coiling on the ground. So much right. <laughs> <laughs> With that outfit and that one, that is probably... Is that a, is that a TIG or, or a FIG <laughs> weld? What are we... Are we It'll moving be here a couple bubble? hours cutting through this thing. <laughs> <laughs> Congrats, Greeny, and all Jets fans That's everywhere. Great. Yeah. How about he just openly said, my intentions is I want to play for the New York Jets. I was yeah. like, whoa, yeah, there this, it was. Yeah. This is the first time now we're going into a season. It's like, okay, we are staring down last place in this division. Aaron Rodgers, Josh Allen, Tua Tonga Valo. Or... Who, or would we like to let's let's get some phone calls on the five hundred no, phone line? Fine. We can just do this right now. No, I mean, yeah, if, if the Dolphins win the Super Bowl, I'll take it back. But if they go ten and six and get their ass beat in the first round, you want me to bow down and smooch to his bunghole? I'm not going to do it. No. Okay, <laughs> you're not smooching his bunghole. Yeah, no. I'm not smooching his bunghole. I'm not tonguing his bunghole or his nutsack. Yeah. Okay, it's not going to happen. Okay. Can't so, do it. Can't yeah. do it. Won't do it. Now my but fight. win a but Super maybe. Bowl. Win a Super Bowl. I'll consider. Smooching to his bunghole. Mike White's better than two. What about AFC Championship? He better consent. They're not going to make the AFC Championship. Well, it would all obviously be above board. Jesus. Yeah, come on. Come on. Think I'm, just, yes. I'm trying to save milk and tie right there. Don't think I'm just sneaking into the locker room and tongue in his butthole without him knowing. <laughs> for those that don't know, okay. I'm trying to make it clear for people. This is all Ty saying that he will not kiss the ass metaphorically. Thank you. Yes. Tongue, tongue punch his butthole. 
So he's at, I didn't uh, say that. He's yeah. added on to it today. Yeah. Uh-huh. And AJ just, you know, trying to clarify it a little bit more. Thank you for doing that, AJ, for the good of the listener. Yeah. But Shut metaphorically, up, what time for people that don't know the show, it's the first time. Right. Ty is saying <laughs> that the Miami Dolphins digital fan base on Twitter. Dolphin. The Dolphin, the Fins Up community, the Fin Fam. Mm-hmm. I don't know what all they they have. They are an active bunch. And he said some disparaging remarks about Tua not being able to survive an entire season. and Which isn't that disparaging at all because he hasn't done it yet in his career. He's back spasm. Again, oh. that's fine. Okay, so they put him on top of Cuck Mountain, which is the worst place you could be in the Finn Fam community. Yeah. They are active. That's perfect. Yes, they are active. It is an all-out assault yeah. all day, all night yep. when you're on the top of Cuck Mountain. Did Gumby make it? Because the work only starts when you get to the top of the mountain, and Ty has gotten to the top of Cuck Mountain, and they are certainly putting in their work they on are. old Ty Schmidt right now. And uh, all you're saying is, I will take back my comment. Absolutely. But to expect me to untie the balloon knot... Yeah. Right now. Don't be expecting With my it. tongue. Can't happen. I'm not doing it, okay? And last time I checked, you don't fucking win Super Bowls in March, okay? Well, you can't lose if Aaron Rodgers wants to go to the Jets. Yeah. Could you imagine, Rap, especially with your job and how often you're on your phone right now, literally. Ooh. Could you imagine going into the dark five days, <laughs> what your emails and texts would be like on the other side? That was that gave me anxiety, just thinking of him turning his phone back on and being like, well, the tone from the Packers changed. It's like, how many other... Mm-hmm. things did you potentially yeah. see and text and how did you get to read that the tone was there and are you talking about right now on your phone about the bucks releasing cameron Brait and leonard Fournette? I, I believe that has happened today i am not talking about it but that did happen today i think both were kind of around the time of the combine um when they were sort of announced but they it, it, you know bucks are intending to release leonard Fournette uh eventually so that's like a cap move so um but anyway um, uh, your question was, I was thinking about for that. Your question was what? See if you can get it. Yeah. You listen. Oh my God. <laughs> you said you were listening. See if you can get it. Go I ahead. was listening, but then Go you ahead, went fucker. to the Fournette thing. No, yeah, I know. Just, let's just Sorry. see if you can get it or not though. Cause it's, it's something that uh, I think, you know, you'd have a good answer to. Yep. So, uh, the other day, um, I was trying to type out some sort of tweet. Here we and I looked at my tweet and it literally didn't make any sense. Okay. And I'm like, is my brain not working? And I think what happens is you sleep so little hours and it's so stressful that at some point your brain stops working. So I think that's the point I'm at. Give me a little hint and then maybe I can figure it out. No, it doesn't matter. We're yeah, past it. But oh my it, it was about it was about basically, could you imagine going in the darkness for five days? Oh, yes, that's right. That's right. And then coming no, out with no. the text messages and you would lose your job probably. You would have been done. Yeah, well, I so... I don't know if you remember this, but there was a time when I was, had to step away from my job for a couple of weeks. Oh, yeah, because you had the boner pill. Yeah, that's yeah. what it was. Is that what it was? Boner pill for... Yeah. Oh, uh, no, no. It was the trim the... Oh, shaving, trim, yeah, shaving you your trim nuts. the that bush, too. the tree stands yeah. tall. Whatever it oh, was, yeah, it's it was. Yeah. It's all in the past. I am Ian Rappaport. <laughs> I want to let you know, if you use this no, manscape... No, no, no. Whenever you trim it, it looks bigger. And they trim it no, with no... no, no. My no, nut cuts. sack feels great. Yeah, what is it? What was their <laughs> thing? We were with Manscaped there for a little bit. Um, it's like uh, Nick... Nick Free yep. Technology. Yeah. Uh-huh. Had, had a Hemi. You're like, wow, I yeah, just I go down here with my phrase. Hemi and my Nick Free. Wah, 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 wah. I just go through there on your Instagram story, and then all of a sudden, Ian Rapport's gone for a week and a half. Something's happening. What, uh, is, what is happening? But anyway. 708, I get a text from Adam Thielen. Want to break news? I waited five minutes, and I said, what's up? And then, bang, Carolina. Three-year deal. Locked. Signed. Sealed. Delivered. Great scoop. I, what was that? Great scoop. You're talking about me? Was over at a friend's house, checking out this friend's two new bulldog puppies, yeah. which are exceptionally cute. Oh, bulldog yeah. Puppies. They're loud. They slobber. What? They're cute. And then, well, yeah, they're a little yeah, they're a little gross. But anyway, whoa, and whoa. I could finally confirmed, and then I reported and was feeling pretty good about myself, only to find my good friend Tom Pell Sarah go, uh, yeah, McAvee had this eight minutes ago. Here we go. Suck it. No! The Rock and Brendan Fraser had a moment. Yeah, that was Yeah, that wasn't staged. What? (laughs) Come on, I thought it's Hollywood, bro. What do you think Yeah, thank you. Fugay is like fake humans? Yeah. No, it no, happened. No, like, no. Frazier was Fugay's. 600 pounds a month ago. How do you think he got down to where he is now? The Rock. No, right? he won Best Makeup at the Oscars. Dewey went up to him and said, listen up, fucker. I know you just won Best best Actor, but no, we're going to act like stop we're having doing a conversation. This. No, stop not. it. You, you guys, saw it. First thing, <laughs> you guys got buddies, caught. you need to stop spinning your shit. Thank you, Nick. You guys got caught lying. 
about the great president that we're going to have in the future. I hope so. Dwayne The Rock. Yeah. Thank you. We'll see. I thought you guys knew something I didn't because you follow the movie world so closely. You guys are like, oh, Brendan Fraser and Rock don't like it. That's, they that's do. a real story. They love each other. Trades are saying Yeah. Trades and tabloids are saying it. Because yeah. of the mummy. Yeah, they love each other. The mummy. Brendan Fraser gave him his big, go- like, you know, hey, let's go. You're the Rock. Let's get you in this movie. And then after that, the Rock took off and left Fraser in the dumps. Was also in What the are you talking about? Left over? The guy's a grown man. What are we, what are we talking about? <laughs> I'm just telling you. I'm talking telling you what they're saying. This is what the tabloids are saying, brother. I don't like what you're saying about. Tara Mana's finder. It's not me. I love Mana. I'm just saying, I'm not saying this. This is what people are talking about happening. Which is an issue with our show every once in a while. Mm-hmm. That's fine, Young Rock And Young Rock, he did say that that was the worst decision of him doing that movie, too. Scorpion King? What? Yeah. I just don't know if I We're going to need a little more context than what you, you just said right there. Any of you seriously? <laughs> Thank you, Nick. <laughs> Drinking those Zevia Deuce. <laughs> I do not like it. It does not taste good. I don't care what. Why are you coming after you. us, dude? It's not bad. You guys yeah, are drinking these Zevia yeah, Hey, look, I get it. It's not dude, dew. How? Of course it's not. I don't it know how this works. It okay? tastes like dew. I don't know how there's zero <laughs> calories, zero carbs. It's the leaf. Zero sodium, zero fat, zero sugars, zero protein, and it doesn't have that aspartame shit in it. Somehow, yeah. this in here, you pop it, it's it the has a full thing. You the know stevia how? leaf that's in it. That's where they come What's up. What's that time? You know how? Yeah. Because it fucking tastes like shit. There's nothing in it. That's that's how. Fine, then fucking put it down and throw it out then, well, no, damn it. No, no, it. fucking you give it back. Give me my... No, I'll have it. I'll I've have had, it. I've had to hold that in for over how there. long you guys But you fucking... sold this like this was a fucking ice cold dude reincarnated. <laughs> it's as, it it's as close as it can get without the I don't know why we're listening to Connor on food and drink takes. The guy does a shop at gas station. This is as close as you can get. Okay? I, I I taste more Sprite in it. Yeah, I, I sure. the it Sprite is not taste. Do, yeah, maybe like uh, like what's the fucking it's other? It's diluted. It's very cut. Yeah. I mean, it's a it's a very watery yeah, drink. Yeah, it's not Ceramist. fucking soda. We know that. <laughs> yeah, guess what? It's not soda. Yes. Good observation, you fuckers. Connor, no, don't lump me into this. Let's blame other people for not acknowledging what we've been up to. Yeah. We found chicken pizza. No, yeah, two yours. three carbs. Didn't we? Donuts. We found donuts on the internet. We've been keto sure, and those hard. those all mm-hmm. tasted great, too. Well, the pizza was pizza delicious. Pizza was good. It was just small. That was the, that was the problem. But the, also, that's kind of what you have to understand. If you're getting something called chicken pizza, you can't eat a lot of it, or else it's not. I see. You know, my big issue with it is it took seven years to get. Like, I don't think they knew the quantity yeah. of sales they were going to get from their social media run, this chicken pizza thing. Yeah, that was just for four of them, too. We just ordered... 45 of them. Yeah, so. because the texture of pizza needs to be back in my life. Mm-hmm. I need pizza, sure. but I'm also on keto. It has worked out. During the weekends, I certainly yeah. get after it. But it's been nice. I have did it all football season. I kind of got after it during the weekends. Now I've added in pickleball in the yeah. morning. Like, I'm working out fasted cardio literally every single morning. I feel like I can live with this for a long, extended period of time. But whenever we are doing keto, Sunday through Friday. It's tough. I would like to add a couple more things potentially in there chicken pizza was awesome mm-hmm. the sprite with no aspartame <laughs> yep has been a great addition yep thank you for this, Connor. thank you for bringing it to our life oh is Zevia healthy i mean yeah hope you, like, hope, you, hope you don't love your kidneys Kiss kidney damage goodbye. i mean you can look up any i've actually uh that oh, so, aspartame oh, thing right. yeah you, i looked up aspartame <laughs> is is aspartame healthy and there's sites that say yes so i mean you can look up and this was 2017. So it's going to make you piss a lot. That's not good. we got to stay hydrated. we got to remember that, which I have felt some effects from. I think all caffeine has a chance to do that. Yeah, liquids also. Allergic reaction? Okay. Just any? No, you've been drinking them, so you'd know already. But I'm just saying that's a risk and a side effect. Allergic reaction. Okay, could be allergic to this entire thing. <laughs> Hypoglycemia or low blood sugar, low blood pressure. That's good, right? You don't want high blood pressure. <laughs> you don't want or low blood high pressure. Either. Low blood pressure, what does that mean? It means my heart ain't moving? Seems healthy. It's yeah. like when you're yeah. too... Everybody pressed. always says no high blood pressure. This yeah. thing's saying I maybe have low blood pressure. Remember what when you, you were uh, consuming all those nameless energy drinks and then uh, you get a little faint, a little lightheaded? You oh, could- that's low blood pressure. I was almost dead. Yeah. That's low blood pressure? I almost passed out live on SmackDown <laughs> five <laughs> times. Drinking that's why? Because I had low blood pressure? Not only I thought it would be the opposite. I mean, you remember the bang days. Oh, in the back of that box truck. I don't know. They're saying this... 
Somebody just fell in your toilet, shut your toilet, blew up your toilet. Something just happened. No, nah, my wife, it's my wife upstairs just, uh, I think, shutting the dryer. So oh, nice. Uh, she didn't poop. Hey, Tara, good luck up there. Woo. Her, her name's Tiffany, but. Yeah. Big, big T, though. You yeah. call it Tara for short. Yeah, absolutely. My wife won't poop in the, when I'm in the house. But if I'm in the house, my wife will not go to the bathroom. The whole house? <laughs> it's poop. Hey, please tell Mrs. Orlovsky I'm a big fan. I apologize for calling her the wrong name. And also, Yo, babe, Pat called you terrible. That's not true. That's not true. I, I mean, my mouth said that my brain was thinking Mrs. Orlovsky. So, I'll, I'll tell her I apologize. I'm a massive fan. Hold on, my wife's gonna be pissed. I did that too. She's a massive fan of your wife, obviously, in this whole thing. But. The whole house? Do you, is there like an outhouse out there? I mean, what what happens? Is that why you're at ESPN? Yeah. That's why you're oh, at ESPN yeah. 13 oh, hours a day. Okay. It makes, makes sense, sense now. Got to get all the poops out before Dano gets back. <laughs> uh -huh. I love your guys' relationship. I love everything about it. It's a fantastic thing. Well, I don't know why Denardo didn't come up with his own if he was that good at weather. Why is he using this guy? Fuck. Holy shit. It's a fair question. Holy it's a fair oh, question. Oh, 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 oh. Why aren't we using the Donardo? Why aren't we using the Donardo? Put him out. Put him out. Put him out. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. He's going to check him out. Yep. Yeah. yeah. He was going to go to surprise sleep. you. Those are the things nice. that happen, though, whenever you slander Leonardo, the dog's name. Yeah, what are yeah. you doing? Why would you ever do that? I don't understand what you're doing. He's been talking to AQ lately, hasn't he? He probably has. No. Do you know AQ Shipley? <laughs> no. Shut up, fuck. Hey, we got donuts, dude. Mm -hmm. You guys talking well, shit on our drinks, and then you're stealing them. Isn't yeah. that interesting? Yeah, it is interesting. You know, I mean, I'm not stealing anything. I wanted to try one. There had been a lot of conversation uh, around it. Okay. I didn't get to try one it, yet, so it, I took one it, sip. Boom. And then you guys attacked me like jackals. Okay. Yeah. It's not just one sip. It's a whole can you took, pal. See, that's the thing, though. And this man can corroborate. I may not like it. I may not enjoy the taste of it. But it has caffeine. And I will drink the whole fucking thing. I'm not yeah. I'm not taking one sip and tossing it away. Yeah. I will not do that. You're not bitching and moaning Listen. either. Yeah, you, you didn't, like, crack it open and waste one. Because how many... Who knows how many of these fucking things All exist? All I've heard know? about is how good these drinks are. They're not bad. It, and you got to try one. Case, They're yeah. so good. The enemy came from within, and he couldn't help it because he was so fucking excited. Monday morning, he came in here. Boys, full fridge of Zevia. Yeah. Feel free. Connor, you yeah. remember those buns? Right. We run out, we'll run out of those two, three weeks. Exactly. And guess they, what? They won't be here. And I'll come back with the Zevias, and everyone will, oh, this isn't soda. Yeah, no fucking shit. But guess what? Everyone's going to be drinking them. Todd looked like it was shit, though. He like, ah. Oh, yeah, it does not taste good. Uh, no, well, soda. So why would you drink it? Thank you. What other options do I have? Soda. That's oh, nice that, you know, that you want. No, that's not healthy. No, drink soda. You had an incredible fucking can of dry ginger ale sitting right there. Well, it? that's because I was coming back from my sickness, okay? And I wanted to make sure, you know. Come on. Come on. You're back from your sickness. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. You've had, but you haven't battled. It's been great to see you back. Yeah, it feels good to be back. But, I, you know, you said it on Monday. You're like, hey, are you, you know, you think you're going to be like a little tired because you were just laying around pretty much laying in bed. And I was like, you know what? The one nice thing about the, the Zevia. Zevio, however you want to pronounce it. Zevio. It may, ta it may <laughs> nice. taste like complete smash dog shit. What is your problem? But Dave? it has caffeine in it. What is this guy's and doing? That's not true. So and you know that's not true. You can get caffeine from. Yeah, there's like, green tea. Like, what? What? There's coffee. What? What? We have ice. What? What? Put that in your coffee. What? No. All of a sudden you have a cold caffeinated drink, which I believe what? is all you were looking for. What? Yeah. And then you know what's happening 45 minutes later. I'm the fucking mayor of butt piss city in there. <laughs> You're right. Okay. And I we'll make it through the that. show. You'll be tapping. Exactly. We need you. AJ Hawk. Yay! Hey, AJ. Hey, What's up? Anything happen? What's going on? Bro, great to see you. A lot has happened, man. It is great <laughs> to have you back. How was your trip? I hope you had a great time. I hope you're refreshed. You look fantastic. Look at he's glowing. Wow. You're glowing. Hey, I forgot AJ, what you look like. You're glowing. You look good, pal. Yep. You say it every time. You say I'm glowing a lot. I appreciate that. Thank you for, for the nice compliments. But yeah, it was nice to uh yeah, we went to Mexico for a few days with the kids and had a good time. It was fun. I love that me saying you're glowing is something you remember because this is what I said to you last time. Uh -huh. And whenever I was saying it I, I, inside, he was like, if this motherfucker doesn't stop. I'm not fucking glowing. Because <laughs> as soon as I said you're glowing again, he said, oh, you yeah, you're saying I'm glowing again. You see, I'm like, he's thought about me saying, you look fantastic. 
Okay, you look great. You look great. You guys all look great. I got. To, I I wish I was able to uh, participate with Sean Casey, but it's very fun to watch that guy do anything. Last time we were at a beer pong table, you weren't able to play. If you do remember, mm -hmm. uh, was, was that in, in L.A.? It was in Michigan. You. Oh, that was yeah. hilarious. Different situation. <laughs> we may have been in Michigan. I was on fucking Pluto. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I was at your bachelor party, and I think you were right there with me. I, I don't remember if you were playing. Oh yeah, what is I was running? Were, I you, was running. If you were, you shouldn't have been. No, yeah, that's why. That was the conversations we were having. Is I was standing, I could not open my eyes. Could, it literally, couldn't open my eyes. <laughs> couldn't open my eyes. Couldn't see anything. Fully awake, could not open my eyes. Ty sitting right here, beer pong player. I think normally we have full beer pong setup happening in Michigan here for the bachelor bachelorette party up there. And we're just kind of playing beer pong, chilling, having a good time, yeah. drinking beers. What? Pizza was ordered by what? IQ. And a lot of pizza. Lot Genius water. order. Oh. But me and Ty, uh, there was a chef that cooked uh, THC food. <laughs> and boy, oh boy. I don't know if anybody ate as much as we did. But that cheesecake was dangerous. Unbelievable. The fucking whole thing. Yeah. And Ty was sitting right to my left. <laughs> the table was right here. And Ty could not move. I could barely move. I was playing beer pong. And all Ty said is, how are you playing? <laughs> How are you playing? Yeah. But even you picked up a ping pong ball in that state of being on cloud 75. Mm -hmm. And I think you've buried three, four straight. I don't think that's going to be a problem over there. The guy who runs the Hustler magazine, I can't think of his Larry name. Larry Flint. Larry Flint right now. Offered, He's dead. He's dead. Offered dead. him a free VIP membership, which I believe is uh, valued at $500,000. Yeah, and what is it? What is the Hustler <laughs> Club? I assume you get your penis sucked. Yeah, you just get blown for free. <laughs> That's what it is? Yeah. Allegedly. And then a couple people who work at I think it's the, it, it's like similar to the Bunny Ranch. They basically said, like, Jimmy G can come in here and have his way with us, and we will not charge him a dime. The ranch? Yeah. I've heard about that ranch. Better, better tip him. They had a TV yeah, show. Tip that, Jimmy. Tip Jimmy will tip. The Hustler. Could you imagine walking into that place and having cameras everywhere and just being like, hey, walk on? Pretty crazy. <laughs> that was crazy. I saw oh, yeah. one. Yeah, the guys that signed off, like, you know, you had to sign, uh -huh. a, you had to sign a waiver for them uh -huh. to show your face, right? When I was on HBO. Hell like, yeah. You give guys me. Do it. Yeah. How much am I paying? 10000 Yeah. That's sure. right. We should do a where are they now on those guys. We should. We, should we know where they that. are. That kind of took over the world there for a bit. Hustle Clubs is similar to that. I did not know that. Yeah, I think so. I didn't know that. I was. I'm not just going to automatically Club. ask you. Allegedly. allegedly, 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 allegedly. I just want to let you know that. I wasn't going to allegedly. I wasn't just going to automatically ask you because uh, I felt that would have been a little bit, you know, too ridiculous. But do you know anything about this place, Pac? Ever heard of this place? Thanks, yeah, I have. You've heard of it? That's yeah. their logo. Though, you yeah, want to go to like, sleep with that? Yes. Right. Like maybe after work then. Like, it's like a I don't want to wake up to that. I know the rest of the no, day. I, rest of the day. It's after dinner. You, you want to watch that after dinner, wow. then after that, maybe get into a some PGA or, yeah, or, you know, a basketball. Watch Baby game. Rock before you go to bed to feel good. Young yeah. Rock, Baby and I know Pebble. why you did what you just did. We're going to the Five Energy phone lines. Let's go to the phones. Young Rock is a great show. Great. Really? I know. Hell yeah. Is that right? Let's go to Arizona on the Five Energy phone. Extended for five more seasons, I heard. I hope so. I mean, I've, I've heard from people who love everything that even the last episode was a little tough. Zito said that to you? I would not Evie? Say that. Uh, yeah. I don't love To anything. all of us. <laughs> all Evie has never bought into Young Pebble. He's not a fool. Oh, shut up. What is Young that? Rock's good show. Oh, okay. it is. That's another, that's another program, the 22 Minutes yeah. episodes. Mm -hmm. it's like with commercials. Well, speaking of 22 Minutes, too. Oh, what? Ted Lasso, first episode of season three. I feel like our audio has been pretty good. Yeah, yeah. ever since Z and that guy fixed it. Jake is his name. Jake. Yeah, Jake the Snake. Jake. You probably didn't hear his name because you were too busy potting. No, no, I was board. probably too busy trying to figure out when the breakfast was coming in without being told. This guy was told we had an early tea time today. And okay, he was we can He didn't let words we, into his ears. We cannot lie to the people about this. We talk about, you know, being a very transparent show. We cannot lie to the people. We cannot tell them. I was thinking about Foxy. Did we tell him? Okay. We definitely told him. All right, everybody present. that was at the situation, <laughs> That's funny, vote eh? on whether or not you told him. <laughs> okay. I, all in favor that we did tell him, say aye. 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 Oh, a bunch of people. All said. opposed, say okay. nay. Nay. Okay, so sure. we're a democracy. That's a, that's a great point. Let's go to the only other person this week that was coming in for morning, you know, pickleball. It was Gertie.
Gertie, you're back there. Were you told, Gertie, this mo- that this morning was going on? You're supposed to arrive at seven. I didn't know about the early oh, tea time, but that's an early Yes, thank you. That's wow. actually that's actually horse shit. I don't know what you're trying to do, Gertie. I was sitting right over there when Pat told you Boom. about the morning. Yeah, Boom, we just got done playing yesterday. Listen, and I he said, said it's gonna be an early tea time tomorrow. I was, I was told. And Tone was a morning. He's a morning. He was told. Okay. Ty was even told. Not normally told. a morning. I, I hear a lot of pole grease. I don't hear a lot of honest truth being told. Right. What are you talking about, Paul Grease? What do you mean? What that you mean? Know. You know the only thing that's getting jacked off right, right, right now yeah. is your memory of the whole situation. Yeah. Yeah. No, there's a lot of Paul Grease, and I have to just sit in the middle of it and no. just be the one. Oh, you're yeah. skiing. Yeah. Yeah. You're, yeah. yeah. you're the one. Pickleball. You can put two or three pickleball courts. Yeah. Uh, ka That's all it is. ka Okay? <laughs> you, got, you got tennis up here, somewhere way above... There, then you got racquetball, these other games, pickleball. Where the hell did that come from? <laughs> sixty. This has been around sixty years, for God's sakes. Now all of a sudden they're saying it's bigger than tennis. I'm like, wow. Whoa. This is a, now, I, I, maybe I, just participation, I, though. You got to think. Maybe it's just participation because, like, we're all. How old are you, Connor? I'm 27. He's 27 years old. Never played tennis. I don't think. Right. Never. Never was once. a tennis player. Nope. But played ping pong. So yeah. like we're ping pong. Take a look players. at him. Look at him. Don't worry. Exactly, John. I weigh 300 pounds. Oh, just teasing you. Just teasing you. Yeah, whatever, dude. But it is great. It is a great little cardio activity that is pretty easy to do. So I don't think that – I think it's going to be a tough road for pickleball to try to catch up to tennis when it comes to prestige, when it comes to, like, sport. Yeah. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. But I think – If that happens, then there's an apocalypse, okay? (laughs) If that happens. So just just keep that in mind. All right, because if we even get close to that, we got some serious problems. Then when you, like, really think about it, you know, not as easy as it looks because, hold on, oh, my hands won't come out of this jacket. Oh, we didn't even see those. I assume those oh, were just in had case. Had no idea, right? No, no, yeah, I had no idea. I thought that was just in case you okay. dropped one. Sure. You were gonna... Where are these coming from? Sure. Oh, look oh. at this guy. Hey. Maybe oh. you should run it back, you know, because guess what? You don't want to do too many beer runs when you're enjoying Bud Lights with the boys. Right. right? All right, that's it. That's all I have. No. No, it's not. <laughs> you know, you we know can that. see those Hold ones. Hold on. Yeah, we saw Hold those. On. Oh, oh, sorry, oh, Joe. Joe. How about Ooh. that? How about that? You know? Oh, man. Let's see if I can. I think I got one more up my sleeve. <laughs> oh, I do. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ty, hold on. I got your third one. <laughs> oh. Hey. You did great work there. Here you go. That's all we have. Just kidding, Bill, catch! Oh, Bill getting one. Watch the face. Oh, oh no! Oh, no! What's that kind of camera? Oh, he dropped no. this camera. you be kidding me. Oh, no! He saved the beer, though. <laughs> Save the Bud Save Light. The beer. Hey, no Bud Lights. We're hurt in this message. It's good. The camera was just broken. Good move, Bill. Drop the $1,400 <laughs> camera and save the dollar that. Bud Light. Bro, we finally got a cameraman. We had somebody taking pictures. It was becoming a routine. I guess that's, hey. That's something that can go on in the hashtag easy carry content. That's right. Did you have him in during the John McEnroe conversation? Yeah, I've had him in since the start of the show. That's why I had two jackets. <laughs> this whole time. I got him fat. He yeah, stuck with he it. Did. That's he, fine. He stuck with it. Match John, I, he has no idea that I got 15 beers on me right now. Is that how many fit you had? Everybody got three beers? 16 beers. Uh, I mean, that old bag of bones wouldn't know what it's like <laughs> drinking beers with the boys with Bud Light today. Hey, cheers to you, pal. Cheers, cheers. to you guys, man. Cheers to you. Buddy in basketball, from the very top all the way down to the very bottom, you're a great you're a great mouthpiece for the league. They're lucky to have you. Last question here as you get back to your rehab. Connor has it for you. Yeah, Shaq, speaking of that, a lot of times. No, no, I don't want to talk to you. I want to talk to the dude in the fucking cowboy hat. He ain't such a dog. <laughs> Tone Diggs. He, he has a gambling yeah, yeah. show every day he's preparing for right now. Tone loves you, too. Shaq, I appreciate uh-huh. that. You guys are on the set. We just talked about the show. You ever say anything just to see if you get Ernie off of his game? I don't like that question. Back to the other one. Right, cool. Connor is uh, awesome. this guy in the other hat. Awesome. No, actually, actually, you know what? You guys may think Charles and I are the funniest. Ernie Johnson is the funniest guy on the set. Uh, Phil Jackson, like I guess how we view him from people that are fans of him have heard all of his, his zen and meditation and everything. Was he what you expected when you got there and you played for him? Are you a supermodel? Because you have the sexiest <laughs> jaw. Hell, hell yeah. That's real, Shaq. He, he, he's on his GF9, but the other stuff, I think. <laughs>